but still really beautiful. Great for the a lot of hosts. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, so these are so cute. I love it. What's his name? I'm I'm tired. <laughs> but the difference with this, Jesus, <laughs> everything is. <laughs> What up, it's your girl, Mena. In this video, I'm gonna show you all my affordable jewelry that I rock on a daily basis. I have a bunch of new items that I have not worn yet that I wanted to show you in the video first. So if you are excited, I want you to give the video a thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed here. Also follow on Instagram. Join my text community because it's free and you should be a part because why not? Like, hello, you could text me one-on-one. -on -one. Ow. Other than that, let's get started. All right, first pair of earrings are the ones that I have on right now. These are from Target. Okay, we're gonna do Target, Amazon, and then I got a little something else I wanna show you too, okay? So these are from Target and these are so adorable. If you watch my weekly vlog, then you saw that I had gone into Target looking for some makeup and I overlooked the jewelry section. To me, it gave me Amazon in the flesh, honestly. Oh, and if you're wondering, this top is, it's a tunic. It's Amazon, I'll link it below in case you're looking at like, well, what top is that? I'll link it below, okay? So this was Target and I was like, oh, who's one? Uh, let me go take a look at the Target section. And I did and I grabbed a bunch of goodies that I love. So I wore these today and and I love them. I also recently got two other ear piercings. I used to have my second hole pierced, but then this was many years ago and the one who did it made them uneven and I hated it. So I stopped using my second hole. Recently, I was like, I wanna wear more earrings all at one time because it's so glam and I felt so restricted. So I went to actually Target. I went to Rowan and Target and got my two ears pierced. So if you're wondering, this is a 14 karat white gold earring stud that I got from Rowan. I haven't taken this one out or switched it because it takes longer to heal. I didn't want to play around with it. This one is Amazon. I did switch this one because I was so eager to try new earrings. I'll get to this one in a second, not to confuse you, but this first thick rope earring is just so cute. The back is open like that. I just love these. I never used to like smaller hoops like this, but they've come into style and I like them on me now. Back in the day, you know, we used to like the big, big hoops and I still do like them. I still like big hoops. I have a few that are old. <laughs> I have this one stone, rhinestone one that y'all always love. It is so old, there's no link to it. So I don't be trying to wear it too much, but it's mad cute, so I do wear it sometimes. And I'm gonna link all the earrings and the necklace and the bracelet. So make sure you look below for all the links to all of these. I'll put them in order of me mentioning them. But, so next we have another hoop from Target. This one is thick. I like this because it's giving big New York, you know, boogie down Bronx hoop earring, but it's not too big, you know what I'm saying? It's definitely a statement earring. I will put each of these on, but wow. Nails and like a lot, it would be a lot for me, but you have the close ups to see it really, really well. But these I love because they give you hoop. They're not too big and they're thick, so they stand out. Love this. Just a staple, you know, in your jewelry collection. Oh, speaking of, let me not forget this. I got this three stack case from Amazon that I love. I'm gonna link this to. I have my earrings on top, rings in the middle, and then bracelets on the bottom. Another hoop that I got from Target. This is A New Day, mind you, if you're wondering the actual brand. It's called A New Day. I love these because it has little ridges. It looks like popcorn, but it's not. When you look into it really well, they're lines. I don't know, but they're so cute. This, I feel like would look really good in the second hole, right? Cause I've been seeing people layer their earrings and I just, it makes me so happy. I cannot wait when I finally take this out. I'll give it a few more weeks before I take that out and switch it into something, to something different. I wanna put, for instance, a small huggy like this back here. And then I can put something like this or smaller in the second and then go bigger so it has a gradient of large, medium, small, all the things. I love it, I love it, I love it. So these are really, really cute. Good to put in your second hole or in the first hole. Honestly, like I could do this in my first hole and leave these as they are, depending on the time of day, depending on where I'm going, what I'm doing. I, I could do that. And these earrings, what I love is that they're gold plated so they are not going to tarnish, at least not in my experience. They ain't tarnishing. Weeks and it did not tarnish. I mean, I've had this on for 
a month now and it has not tarnished. This is Amazon, okay? Now, here's another one from A New Day, Target. This is really cute. I haven't worn this one yet. I like how it has three in one and it goes small, big, small, just the way it's layered. I love this. I think this is really, really cute. This one, I wouldn't do too much in my second and third because this is such a statement. I would keep it kind of simple, but you know, it depends. You might want to really kill them softly with a whole bunch of gold if that's what you're trying to do with that look. It all depends on what look you're going for, but I like this. I saw this and I was like, I have to add this to my kit. So let me know below if you like any of these three hoops or four, this is the fourth one. Which of these hoops are you feeling right now? Comment and let me know. Now you've seen this on me several times. It is my JBW watch and you have the close up here. You can see that it is iced out. I think it has diamonds and cubic zirconias in it. If you have seen an influencer talk to you about JBW in a sponsorship, comment and let me know. Girl, I've seen so many JBW sponsorships, it's nauseating. So I just finally was like, well, I mean, I guess I might as well buy it because <laughs> y'all keep on talking about it. That's how marketing works, okay? They wear you down and you're like, okay, well, dang, I mean, fine. So I bought it and I love this watch. It is blingy AF. It is bomb. I just love it. It's not a watch I'm gonna wear in the shower and all of that. No, ma'am. I just go put it up when I'm done, put it on when I'm ready. I love how blingy it is. I love the two-tone. Yes, this is a watch that you need. End of story. Everybody got coupon code except me. <laughs> So I don't have one to give you, but use someone's coupon code, baby, and grab this watch. It is so sexy. It takes up every outfit. You can have on gym clothes, honey, and you might dress it up with some makeup, some hair, and you throw this on, you are good to go. Now, I always wear this with my Amazon tennis bracelet. This tennis bracelet is giving luxury on a budget. This tennis bracelet is beautiful. It takes up any look. In fact, I had two of these, one broke. It is like costume jewelry, so don't expect any kind of longevity, but be delicate with it. This is so beautiful. It takes up the look so much. It makes it look so expensive. And I love that, you know, like why not? All right, so the next piece of jewelry is actually from a black owned brand. I saw her ad on Instagram and I had to get it. It's this ring right here that I wear only when I have my long nails on, honey, not at night, not in the shower, not to wash my hands, none of that. I just don't want to bother. My hands get swollen and I just want free, I want to be free and peaceful when I want, you know, lotion my hands. I don't want all this stuff on it. So I just take my rings off when I'm not doing something. This says she can do all things on it and I love it. It's a black owned brand and the owner is really sweet. After I purchased, she emailed me and was like, how are you liking it, this and that? I'm like, oh, I'm liking the, the hands-on touch you're doing right now. So I appreciate that. And it was affordable to me. She has a lot of other options that I've been seeing. I keep on getting the ads. Yo, IG be out here stalking us, okay? I keep on seeing her ads and I'm like, ooh, I want that and that and that and that. So I'm gonna link it below if you wanna support a black owned brand. She didn't ask me to, I just felt like it because this is really, really cute and I love the inscription. It's such a great reminder. I just love it, okay? I love it. So now let's move on to Amazon jewelry. Now, this first one I believe is called a Huggy because it hugs the earlobe. Don't get me mistaken, I think that's the name of this one. I know there's another one that's definitely called a Huggy. I'm not sure if this one is. I love it. It's got the rope detail, very identical to this one. So this would complement this earring so well if you have two holes or three. I can see myself putting this rope small Huggy right here, wow. And then even keeping this like that or moving this back, like it just depends, you know? But this is really, really cute, easy to put on. I can definitely see myself wearing this day and night. These do last with the water, washing my hair, showering. I haven't had issues with the Amazon stuff. I just haven't done it with the Target. These are bigger. I wouldn't wear this to bed in the shower. It's just too big. What I do is I keep in the second and third day and night and then I change the front. So that's what I've been doing, at least for now. I'm having a lot of fun having three ear piercings. Comment and let me know how many ear piercings do you have? I've been having way too much fun. I don't know what took me so long. It wasn't on my mind, but it recently came on my mind. I'm like, yes, I need I need three ear piercings. It's, it sounds more like me, you know? This next huggy is real simple. A real simple gold huggy will take you a long way. This is just pretty basic. Now this I can see putting in my last, in my third, and then putting perhaps the one I just showed you in my second, and then this in my first, right? It'll give me all yellow, really stand out statement earrings that I can see myself doing. So when I change this out, I may end up putting this one in there. We'll see. This is real gold, so I'm not gonna like get rid of it, but you know, I wanna do a little bit of, I wanna have fun with my ears. I have fun with my hair, my nails, my clothes, my makeup. Now the idea of doing it with my earrings makes me so happy. This other huggy, now this one I had on for weeks and I love. I love how 
it has a little piece down at the bottom that shakes and dangles. It is the cutest. I wore this in my first hole with these two and I loved it so much. I just wanted to give other earrings a try. Love this so much. Definitely for the first hole, maybe even for the second hole. Yes. Yo, this is so cute. It's so festive. Gosh, it just looks like a party, a party in your ears. I just found this randomly on, on Amazon and I was like, I need this now. I love this set so much. I wore this shower, washing my hair, never had any issues. Now here we have a small rope hoop earring, not a huggy because it's a little bit bigger. This can certainly go like this can go in the second one right now if I wanted to, or certainly in the front, depending on how big you like your hoop earrings to be. This is not heavy, by the way, FYI, which I love because that's important. No one wants their ears to be hanging and ripping and all of that stuff. No, ma'am. These are very lightweight, which is great. I like this a lot. I haven't worn this yet, but the the style is definitely mad cute to the kid, okay? Now, this next one right here, the tiny, tiny huggy with the stones in the front is what I have on right now. I got two sets of them. So I've had this on day and night, no issues with it. It's great. So I can see myself putting two of them on. What's cute is that the front of it has the stones, not the back, cause you don't need it in the back. Like, what's the point? It's cute. I got two of them because why not? One of these came in a trio and then I had already purchased this by itself. That's how I got two of these. Love this one. It's so cute. It just gives you stone. It just gives you like glam in a real subtle way. Love that. The nurse who did my ear piercing at Rowan did such a great job spacing everything out because you know, if I put on, let's say a GG earring right here, you need space between that and the middle and like all that stuff. You got to space them out. So she did a great job. I love this huggy. It's so cute. Now, this is chunky. This can definitely go in the third or the second ear. It's just so chubby. It's a chubby huggy. <laughs> When I think of this one, I'm like, I just want to squeeze your thighs like a like chicken turkey thighs on a baby. I have not worn these yet. I cannot wait to wear them. I love this so much. I see myself having so much fun pairing this because it is just the cutest. Again, it, for me, with these earrings, now that I have three holes, it's just about playing around and being like, oh, what does this look good? What does this look good? What should we do? What should we add? You know, whatever. I love the whole thing, you know? And then I got this because I've been seeing the guys wearing this, the dangling cross earrings. I'm seeing the man's wearing that. What is that about? I know that for some, um, it indicates you being gay and uh, in other ways it doesn't. I Googled it. I don't know how true that was. I've seen gay and straight men wear these dangling cross earrings. I've seen women wear it too. I think they are so, so cute. I have earrings like this from Aldo. They're bigger and I wear them in my front in my first hole. I can see myself putting this on in my second. It'll be a little bit different because I don't feel like I have to stick with hoop hoop hoop. I'm gonna do what I want to do. You see what I'm saying? And girl, I'm having a lot of fun with this silk press, touching it and moving it. Don't mind me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Don't mind me. I can see myself putting this on right now, you know, just right there because let me take it out. Not with these nails though. I got to take these nails off to come and be switching out earrings. But I think this is so cute. It would just add a little something different to my ear, right? Like it just kind of makes me feel like, hi, love that. And then we got some Amazon hoops. Now, these have subtle differences to them. I'm now realizing that this looks like the Target hoops that I got. Although the Target hoops are a lot thicker, okay? Then you have the Amazon ones, not as thick. But this would be really cute in the front hole, not as thick. So if you're wanting hoop earrings that are thick, but not as chunky, then these ones from Amazon are gonna be perfect. Love those a lot. Then, so these ones right here are a little bit different than the ones that I just showed you from Amazon. And that's because of the beginning of it. It has a teardrop design to it in a sense. So it starts off thin and then gets thick versus this one that I had just shown you is thick all the way around, just like the Target one. When I got in the mail, I was like, this looks like what I already have, but it's a small difference, whatever. Girl, these are so affordable that I was just like, just give me all of them, okay? Just give them all to me because even these ones all also from Amazon <laughs> look like what I already have, but they're thinner. They're thinner hoops. They're not the same, okay? Every hoop is different. So these are thinner hoops, more dainty, more simple, perhaps not as standout-ish, maybe every day for you. Depending on if you are a hoop girl every day, comment and let me know. This is definitely a beautiful, lightweight option 
for you, okay? And then we got a bracelet and necklace set. Now these are separate, they come as a pair, but they don't come together, okay? So you have the bracelet, you can pick your initial. I got the M for my bracelet. It, it's just so cute to stack up and then stack it up with other stuff. I like to put it on my right hand because then when I'm filming and I'm putting on makeup, you see it dangling on my right hand. That's what I like to do. And then this one, what I love is that it comes separately. So if you wanted to wear just this long necklace, you could, if you wanna put them together, you could. Because there are some necklaces that come together and you can't break them up. You're stuck with them like that. You might not wanna do that every single day. I love that. And they both have the option for you to pick a letter. On the necklace, I chose A for I to be able to whatever. Just choose whatever, whatever letter you wanna choose. Now this necklace right here, you might be thinking, well, where's that one from? This, honestly, I have a bunch of necklaces from random places. I think this one is from mynamenecklace.com. I don't remember the name. It's been a long time. I wear this day, night, shower, everything, and it has not tarnished at all. This costume jewelry is getting better and better, honey. I mean, they're doing a great job. This stuff is lasting very, very well. So that is the end of all of my affordable jewelry that I wanted to show you. Let me know which of these you are loving. Comment below. Also, use my links in the description because I prepared all of them for you to make your life easier, okay? Let me know if you like this video, if you want more videos like this. As always, glad you're here, and thank you for watching my videos. It makes my heart so happy. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.